Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install a game loop emulator on your Windows 10 operating system. So let's get started. So first of all, just open your, up your favorite browser and search for game loop and the first link which will appear here will be from gameloop.fun. So I'm going to just click on this link. So uh, right now it's opening PUBG Mobile, the official emulator on PC. You can uh, download this emulator for playing PUBG but I want to download the game loop emulator. So I'm going to just uh, click on this home page button, which is going to just uh, lend me to the home page of this game loop website. And straight away, you will be able to see this download button here. So I'm going to just click on this download button, which is going to start the download. And once this executable file is downloaded, I'm going to just click on this file and then click on yes, and then just minimize the browser. So now as you can see the next window you will see here will be uh, this kind of window and on the top uh, game loop logo will be there and here you can uh, browse for the games using these categories right. So as you can see at the bottom the progress bar is shown and here I can see uh, the installation process is complete up to 7%. So just let this installation to uh, just complete and let this uh, progress bar to go to the 100% mark. Then only this emulator will be uh, installed successfully on your Windows 10 operating system. So I will wait for that. As you can see, my uh, internet connection is very slow. So I have to wait for it. So now this emulator is installed on my Windows operating system and I can also see this uh, game loop icon which is created on my desktop. Now let's uh, see how uh, we can change the settings inside this game loop uh, emulator. So for that you just need to click on these three sticks icon and then click on the setting option. And here you can do some basic settings for example if you want to change the language you can change the language from here and if you want to change the other settings like run at startup or hide advanced watermark so from here you can change the basic settings of this emulator if you want to change the engine settings then click on engine here and then you can choose all those settings related to engine so for example for anti-alias this is close for now so i can change it to ultimate then memory so memory is auto you can change the memory according to the memory available on your windows operating system for now i'm going to leave it as auto processors also you can change it uh, according to the processors available on your windows operating system if you are not sure just leave it as default then the resolution so you can change the resolution here I have uh, two resolution first one is this one and uh, second one is this one this also depends upon the resolution of your Windows 10 operating system so if I just change it to this resolution this window is going to look bigger okay so let's change this resolution here and then you can change the DPI from here and also speaker which you want to use for playback and if you want to record your voice you can choose the microphone from here and once you're done you can just click on save and it's going to say done the setting will take effect the next time you open uh, the game loop emulator so i'm going to just click on ok and then i'm going to close this game loop emulator and then once again i'm going to just start this game loop emulator once again when i go to the settings option and go to the engine option now I can see that this resolution is changed here. Okay. So this is how you can do the settings. Now in order to install some games, so let's say I'm going to install this PUBG. For that, you just need to click on the game you want to install and then you can just click on the download button here. You can also know uh, which type of game it is or which version of uh, the, the game you are installing and then the last update and the developer also you can see the system requirements here for example for pubg i need uh, this uh, windows operating system and above and minimum memory i need is 2 gb and recommendation specs are also given here so 
Windows 7 or above and minimum memory is 8 GB or above and the graphics card specifications are also given here. So here also you can see uh, it has started the download of this PUBG on this emulator. So once this uh, uh, installation is finished, I will be able to uh, play PUBG on my game loop emulator. Also, I can log in with my account here. So I, when I click on login here, it's going to allow me to log in with my Google account or my uh, Facebook account. So you can uh, log in with your account and it's going to give you the additional features. Now, once you have downloaded the game, you will be able to see your games here under my games. You can see this uh, game is downloading for me PUBG. And if you download other games, you can see the other games also. In the live section here, you will be able to see the live games here and you can go live from uh, here also from this live section. Here also you can change your uh, language. So if you want to change the language from here, you can change the language. And if you want to log in to Nemo TV, then you can log in into the Nemo TV from here also. So this is how you can download and install Game Loop Android emulator on your Windows 10 operating system. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next video.